is six Polpera Mews and we are outside the front door and we're coming in through the hall and it's um, 9th of November at 5pm. Going through the hall, on your left you have a lovely um, cloakroom, guest room, guest cloakroom rather, with basin, shower, floor to ceiling tiles and WC with a large radiator. Coming back now on the right hand side from the hall is the sitting room, reception room with the day bed. All the furniture can remain or be taken. And then you have the conservatory. Unfortunately, we're here at night time, so it's a bit dark. But this is the outdoor conservatory on the side because this house is semi-detached. So you have a side um, conservatory with a front gate there, which again can be opened up so that you have a front garden. This is the front room, as we said, bay window there. Then you come through here and again, still in the hallway on the right hand side is the laundry. So you've got a washer and dryer and this is under the stairs. So you've got plenty of room to um, hang clothes and wash clothes. That's here. Then you come into the open plan living area, which has got um, a large um, five point hob and oven, grill, lots of storage, floor to ceiling, lovely new cupboards, only done a year ago. It's all brand new, double American fridge with again, floor to ceiling cupboards, all bespoke custom made, dining table and chairs, skylight, garden, which again, I'm afraid is dark. Sorry about that. And then you have the side entrance here to go into that um, um, side conservatory, which has glass doors. Now we're going up to the first level. Like I said, it's a semi-detached, so you've got windows on the side up the stairwell. Come to the first landing and you have the large sitting room, which can also be used as a bedroom. As you can see, they've put a bed and a table. There's a fireplace there, um, which is one of the, um, this is all connected, it's gas. Stove, then you have the WC, bathroom, bath with shower, large mirror, large unit, storage units, floor to ceiling tiles. Then you go into a smaller, this is the smallest bedroom in the house. It, it's got fitted, or oh, not, oh, stand, standalone wardrobes with um, a bed and side cupboard. Another bedroom here, large bedroom, very well decorated as you can see. Another freestanding wardrobe, bed and more cupboards. In here you have all the linen. There's linen here, so fully equipped with linen. So this house is ready to go um, for anyone that is going to be moving in. Go upstairs to the top level. Again, another window on the side. And you have, this is in the loft. So this room, as you can see, is in the loft, but this can be opened out. So you can actually open this because you have permission because it's on a private road, so you'll be able to open this out. Then you have a built-in wardrobe here, built-in storage rather, and then again, another bathroom, large heating rail, floor to ceiling tiles, shower and bathroom. And then you go in here, and this is more like a studio, um, artist studio with a very large um, storage unit here as well. But again, this can all be opened out so that you have a large dormer at the back here and you have a full head height on this level, which can all be done 
and has been done by neighbours um, right next door. Okay, thank you.